naputok, naputok ang ating makeup. Oh my gosh, this is my first time na gagawin ko. Alam mo ba ang dati na nanonood lang ako yung Ann Klutz? So the products that we're going to talk about today are gel stains from the premium stain. My lips are ready. I'm Faya and welcome back to our channel. So today, hindi po tayo magmumukbang. We're gonna do lip products presentation or sabihin na rin natin review. So kung napansin nyo po, talagang mmm, putok na putok ang ating makeup. Kasi nga, may gagawin tayo ngayong swatches. We're going to try some gel stains on our lips uh, para makita natin kung ano yung magiging look niya on our actual face. So yun po, wala po akong Ganap, pula po kung kung anong kambot ngayon. We're just gonna do some product review. So the products that we're going to talk about today will be the gel stains from the premium stain. Disclaimer lam po ha, hindi po tayo beauty guru, beauty experts. Any information or comments na sasabihin ko are all mine. It's just my own uh, personal opinion. So it's more of like ano lang, chill, chill, or parang simple ng kwentuhan lang or share, share lang. So. If you watched my uh, vlog last week where um, I had this mukbang with my dog Hope, so don um, slightly na open up ko lang sa inyo or na share ko lang sa inyo yung yung ginagamit ko that time, which was of course yung gel stain on my lips, which was Lou, and uh, on my cheeks was the creamy stain na Atalia. The premium stain they have six shades. And alam niyo naman po yung favorite ko, diba? Na yun yung Lou. But today, we're going to try five different shades naman. My lips are ready. So, we're going to try first uh, Cherry. Oh my gosh, this is my first time na gagawin ko to. Alam mo ba, dati nanonood lang ako ka kay Ann Klutz. So, ginagawa niyo to. And sobrang amazed na amazed ako. And oh, by the way. Tayo na lang natin muna siya mag-set. And ngayon, itatry naman natin siya sa lips natin. So, I have my compact mirror here. This is from Maybelline. Woo! Okay, here we go. Okay, how is it? A little goes a long way talaga. So, hindi yun na kailangan uh, siyang kapalan kasi it's highly pigmented. So, konti lang yung ilalagay nyo. Huwag kayong mag-carried away, okay? Kasi baka akalain yun na ano siya. Yung parang pag-glide yun ng ganon. Ah, mandipis lang. No, it's not. This one's highly pigmented talaga. So, konti-konti lang. Tapos, isuspread nyo lang siya sa ano. So, sa mga may hilag ng medyo darkish red, um, this one has a parang, it's like brownish, orangey, reddish shade. Yeah, this one's nice. Yung talagang, mmm, yung naglalakad na lips. Sabi nga nila, so vega. So, nag-dry na konti. Yun na. Hindi naman siya nagkakalayot sa swatch niya, di ba? So, kung ano yung color ng swatch, hindi sila magkalayot yung sa actual talaga ng lip application na. Hmm. Oh, di ba? So, once again, ladies, this is the shade of cherry. Huwag din kayong mag-alala kasi baka sabihin nyo na like other lip tints or other lip stain products, di ba? Mapait sila. Tapos, parang iba yung amoy. Ito naman hindi. Hindi siya mapait. No. Wala siya yung parang amoy chemical talaga. And, um, all of premium stains, um, gel stains, they use all natural ingredients. Ilalagay ko din yung mga ingredients ng, ng gel stains. So, you'll be rest assured na hindi chemical yung ina-apply mo sa lips mo. Alright, so this time naman, we're going to try the second shade and it's gonna be Cory. Hindi siya basa-basa matatanggal, so I need to uh, do or to apply 
makeup remover tapos nilagyan ko lang siya ng foundation para di ba hindi magano yon hindi ma manipulate yung color niya kasi di ba may shade na tayong nilagay kanina so again this time the second shade that we're going to try on our lips will be Cory Para siya may pagka-maroon. Wait, ayusin lang natin. So, let's wait for this one to set in sa arm natin. And we're going to apply this one in our cheeks. <laughs> on our lips. On our lips na. So, again, wala siyang, hindi siya amoy chemical. Fruity. Yeah, there's a parang scent ng fruity. So, okay, we're going to try this one on. Ito na! Mmm! Mmm! A little goes a long way talaga. Pantay na ba lips ko? Ah! See? Sobrang pigmented niya. This one is nice. Let's check on the swatch. Ayan, nag-dry na siya. This is Cory. Or, makapangit lang yung pagkakaswatch ko. Oh my gosh! Hindi talaga yung shade ko. Hindi talaga ako mahilig sa ganito na shade. Kasi nga, it's very bold for me. It's very bold for my personality. Uh, let's check yung swatch ng Cory. Ito. Hindi naman nagkakalayo din, di ba? Parang siyang... Pag makapalan mo siya, which uh, yung nangyari sa akin, kasi nga, yung pag-apply ko, hindi siya nag-even agad. So, yung parang... Okay na sana yung konti lang kanina, pero since uh, parang din nadamihan ko, um... Okay siya kung manipis lang. Kasi parang, parang ano lang siya, parang ka-shade lang siya ng lips mo. Eto, at least may comparison tayo. Eto yung pag kinapalan nyo ng pag-apply. Sexy, dark shade. Parang rock starry shade siya. For my personality type ha, this one would be better if medyo light shade yung pag-apply ko. And we can! We can do that. Pwede natin bawa bawasan yung shade. Let's try. Okay, so what you can do is yung sa, sa cotton, lagyan yun ng makeup remover. Konti lang, yung slightly damp lang. Then we're going to wipe konti yung sa lips para maging lighter yung shade niya. Okay na ba? At least nag-lighten. Ayan. Better. It's actually lighter this time. Kaya nag-red yung dito ko. Pagtanggal ko na ano. This is more me. Kasi kanina nga, nakapalan ko siya. Diba kakasabi ko lang na parang huwag ma-carry the way. Ayun, nag-care daw yung lola mo. Kayo nakapalan kanina. Pero this time, this is better. Wala siyang transfer. Oh, di ba? And mas okay yung shade niya. For me, ha? For my taste. Mas okay siya pag light. Again, yung swatch. So, lighter na yung lips ko. Kasi nga, binawasan natin ng konti. Pero still, it's maganda. I love it. It still looks natural. Hindi yung talagang... Yun. I like Cory. I like Cory then. See? Parang... Hindi siya malayo dun sa color ng ano mo. And since, di ba, hindi... Hindi siya... Hindi siya natatanggal agad-agad. So, parang... The more na magstay siya sa lips mo, tapos unti-unti siya mag-fade, parang mas nagiging look natural siya on your lips. Okay, so go naman tayo ngayon sa shade na ginagamit ko currently. I'm currently using Lou. So, naglagay uli ako ng makeup remover dito. Tapos, nag-tap lang ako ng konting um, foundation para hindi man yung shade. So, 
This is the shade of blue. Yan. <laughs> Palang hindi pa sanay sa swatches, no? <laughs> Pagpasensyahan yun na po. So, wait natin mag-set yung shade ni Lou sa arm natin. And we're going to apply it na to our lips. Again, wag ma cared away, okay? Hindi <laughs> tulad ng kanina sa Cory. Buti na lang nare medyo han natin. Pero still naman, okay pa rin naman yung Cory. Pero, di ba, dun sa mga mahilig talaga sa mga makakapal na shade. Pero sabi ko nga, it's not my type of personality kasi hindi talaga ako yung typical na makapal mag-makeup kung walang okasyon. So, pag everyday makeup lang, yung parang light lang, yung parang basa lang, magkaroon lang ng colors, ba ma-enhance yung anong dapat i-enhance sa eyes, dapat i-enhance sa cheeks para maging blooping naman tingnan. Ano anyway, yung dami kong gala. Go na. This is for the shade of blue. Tulad din sa mga iba dyan na mahilig sa mga lip stains or lip tints, uh, mas maganda talaga, hintayin muna natin mag-set yung product dun sa lips natin before talaga tayo yung parang go na or parang, oh, this is the final look. Kasi nga, pag tulad ng ganito, medyo ano pa siya, yan. As much as possible nga, hindi ka muna talagang mag-ano eh. Para madaldal ako. Kasi once mag-set na talaga siya, ang ganda niya kasi parang talaga nagbe-blend siya. Tapos since ano, di ba, yung parang as you go on with your day, hindi naman talaga natin may iwasan yung parang nakapa ganun tayo. Mannerism Maner na kasi talaga natin yun, di ba? So unti-unti siya mag-fade. The more na nag-fade siya, parang mas naging look natural on your lips. So again, this is the shade of blue. Let's see. Oh, what can you say? Lip stains from PPS are non-transferable. Kahit na magmukbang kayo or may mga event kayo. Kaya gusto rin to ng mga, ng mga high school students eh. Kasi diba, yung sa high school, alam niyo naman din naman na tayo mahilig yung sa mga retouch-retouch. Kung ano yung ilalagay natin sa pagmumukha natin. Parang yun na yung parang long-lasting talaga. Gusto natin na effect. I really love the shade of blue. Bias talaga pagdating kay Lou. Aside, nagusto ko si Lou sa PBB. So, yan. Gusto ko rin yung Lou ng premium stain. So, I'm going to take this one off na so we can try at the next shade naman. I'm gonna say bye-bye now to Lou. Bye, Lou. Going for our next shade, I'll try Ina. Okay. Para siyang orange. Let's see. Is it? Oh! Ah, para siyang orangey. Okay. Ba't talaga ako dito sa may inner? Sa swatch. This is Ina. Parang I would like this shade then. Okay, let's try and wag ma-carry it away. Hmm. Okay siya. Manipis lang. Orangey yung effect niya, no? Nice. Matingka din siya titingnan sa lips. Not like the Barbie one, ah. Kasi diba Barbie is parang yung more on Lou. Kasi pink siya. Ito naman, okay siya. Orangey yung ano niya, yung dating niya. Still, still vibrant siya sa lips. And... Yan. Wag dung kapalan. This is me. This is me. Kakapalan ko ba? Contact. Kasi pag ganito siya, okay na siya sa akin eh. We can add a little bit more. Parang may second favorite na ako sa gel stains. Nice. I like it. Okay, so itong shade na to, again, it has para an orangey effect. So, 
So, parang may imagine ko to yung sa mga ano, when you are in the on the beach. So, yung mga parang Coachella gathering. Siguro pag may mga Coachella event akong aatenan, I would wear this shade. Yeah. Sorry, nakatingin ako sa screen ko ah. I like it. I should say so far dun sa one four shades to na try natin. This is my second favorite so far. Again, no, wala siyang parang bitter taste. But I can get enough of this. Para mas matagal pa tong pinagstay ko siya sa lips ko kasi sa loom. Pero still, this is so far my second favorite after loom. I may wear this today since may kembot na naman ng lola natin. Let's see. I've gotta say bye bye to Ina for now, and it's time for me and the makeup remover to meet once again. Hindi pala talaga biro no yung mga ginagawa ng mga beauty vloggers pag nagre review na sila. Lalo na yung mga lip products kasi takes time siya and mahapdi siya sa lips. So talagang wow, kudo sa mga beauty vloggers. A few moments later. And this time, let's try naman, Sasha. Para siyang what? Same with Corey. Let's check. Yeah, this one's darker than. Para same siya with Corey. Okay. <laughs> dito na naman sa inner ko, ano ba yan? Sabi na nga kasi dito banda eh. Kami si tuloy tingnan ng swatches ko. Sabi pa ng mga beauty experts na ko, newbie na newbie talaga. Well, I am. And I can get used to this then soon. Lahat naman yan. Eh. Let's wait for this one to set in. Napaka-messy tuloy ng swatches ko na. Asensya na. Let's try this one on our lips. And hinahinay lang tayo kasi baka matulad tayo sa Cory kanina. Talagang na-shocked ako. Na-shocked. I didn't expect na ganun siya ka. So, yan. Let's try. Yeah. This one's dark. Yeah. Ayan. Okay. So, what I can say about the color. Tingin ko mas dark siya kaysa kay Cory. Ito talaga yung parang dark. I don't know. For me ha, parang there's no shade of red na. Parang ano na siya, dark violet na talaga siya. Parang dark violet maroon. Yan. Kasi yung Cory kanina, maging ganito yung shade niya pag nakapalan mo. Diba nung kanina, um, uh, nag- nag-erase tayo ng konti dun sa Cory para mag-lighten siya. And parang naging uh, same siya ng color ng lips mo. Pero this time, di ba konti lang yung nilagay ko. Pero sobrang dark na niya talaga. So, ito yung parang maroonish violet combination. Parang I don't see any red on this one na. Kung meron man, sobrang sobrang minimal. This one's also yung parang pang ano din. Parang for night night events then pero i still see some other girls din naman na um ginagamit nila tayong ganitong shade even on daylight o yung parang uh, regular na ano pero still it's nice wag lang kapalan talaga kasi sobrang konti lang yung nilagay ko and it's so dark na yan maroonish violet yung same uh tama yung pagkaka-describe ko pero for me yeah, it looks like it Still, it looks nice. Dun sa mga mahilig sa mga dark colors. But then again, for me, uh, I'm not into this shade really personally. Kasi nga, I'm not into like dark shaded na, ano, na lip products. Pero, okay pa rin naman. So once again, that is the shade of Sasha. Oh, before I forget, dun sa ano natin. Ito yung swatch ni Sasha. And this is on my lips. Okay, hindi ko siya kinapalan. So, time to say bye-bye to Sasha. And this time, it's gonna be on to the last shade, Emmy. Alright, we are down to our last shade. And this is Emmy. Okay. 
Okay, it's watch time. Oh, what a violet effect then, Sammy, on my arm, ha? <laughs> Malayo ko na naman sa katotohanan ba yan? Dito ko kasi siya nilalagay, kasi pag nakaganan ako, parang feeling ko na, no? Ito pala siya dapat. It. Oh my gosh, it's so messy. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so it's my fault. It's not the product's fault. It's mine. I don't know how to do swatches yet, but give me time to learn. I'm so sorry. Anyway, let's wait for the color to set in. So, I'm not then. And we're going to try the product now on our lips. Okay, moment of truth. This one's nice. Emmy has a combination of parang violet pink. Just going to wait for the product to set in. It's a combination of violet and pink. Yeah, for me. I don't know kung kita sa camera. Where's the violet and red? Parang siya violet and pink sa malapitan. I like Emmy too. Yeah. Well, well, well. Yeah, this one looks nice then. It's second like the shade of Emmy. Okay. Ah, ito yung pagka swatch ko. Sorry, ito yung parang pinaka messy sa lahat ng swatches ko. Ah, uh, then again, kung nakikita niyo, parang it's a combination, parang mix ng violet and pink. And that's what I see on my lips then. Kasi pag yung talagang malapitan siya, parang dominant yung... Hindi ko rin masasabing dominant yung pink. Violet talaga siya, pero may pink siya na ano eh. So yun. Alright! And this is our last shade uh, to try. And this is the shade of Annie. All right, so there you go. All six shades of premium stains, gel stains. So, ito yung mga swatches nila. The first one that we tried is a Cherry. Then followed by Cory. Then ito yung si Lou. Ito naman si Ina. Then Sasha. Then Emmy. So, what I have on my lips now is yung second favorite ko na nga, na si Ina. So, then again, guys, these are just my personal take about the product of Premium Stains, Gel Stains, Shade Selections. So, uh, if uh, you're going to let me choose what would be my yung parang pinaka-favorite ko down to my not least favorite, not really least favorite in a sense, a negative yung connotation niya, but it's just that... Um, I rank it as my least is because hindi ko siya talagang shade. Yung parang ganon. Kasi hindi siya nag -ano sa personality ko. So again, my top one will be Lou, of course. Then again, followed by Ina. Then I should say my next one will be um, I like Emmy. Yeah, I like Emmy. Then it's gonna be followed by Corey. Then my last will be Sasha. So that's how I would rank um, the gel stains, shade selections of the premium stain based on my personality and my shade preference. So again, we are not um, beauty experts, we are not beauty guru, ordinary yung tao lang po tayo, ordinary yung uh, consumers. So uh, I'm just uh, sharing to you uh, what the product or what's my take on the product. So ayan. 
All right, so if you're interested with the premium stains, shell stains, uh, shade selection, you may want to go ahead to your nearest uh, TPS outlet. Now, if you are interested on the business side demand of TPS and you are interested to be a reseller, you may want to go ahead and contact your local distributor and inquire on the mechanics and how to be one. All right, thank you again for spending the day with me and see you in our next vlog. Bye!